What's going on everybody? This is Tex, back here with you with another Tech T Tuesday here from Emerald City Harley Davidson. Today what we're going to go over here is we're going to talk a little bit about proper adjustment of your gear shifter. One, so that you can get the best comfortability out of your ride while shifting. Also to get proper gear engagement and shipment every single time so that you don't miss a shift as little as possible. I know a lot of people get out there on these hot rides like this and they want to get out there and just hot dog it and shift as hard and fast as they can. Well, sometimes you might miss a shift. So what we want to do is get this adjusted as best and close as we can so that way you don't miss a shift and you're as comfortable as you can be so that you can ride all day long. So first what we're going to do is definitely get in here and we're going to adjust the gear shifter. This is probably the easiest thing for anybody to get here to do. Each family of motorcycles are different. You have the touring models. This here, we're doing this on a uh, 2020 Softail. Uh, you also have your Sportster models. Each gear shifter setup is just a little bit different. Read your service manual for torque specs, specifications, things like that. Uh, here, you want to get a half inch socket and a half inch wrench. Loosen up the pinch bolt here. You can take the gear shifter off. You can move it up and down. It's on a spline shaft for security purposes so that you don't miss. Get it into a good adjustment where you feel close to it, where everything feels close enough, comfortable to you. You want to make sure that you have your gear shifter not too far up, not too far down, because that can overexert your ankle up or down as well which could probably tire you out a little bit sooner than what you want to be. We want to keep you as comfortable as you can so that you can ride as long as you can, so that you can enjoy your day, enjoy these beautiful uh, summers, winters, whenever you're out there riding. Put your pinch bolt and your nut back in there. Go ahead and again, check your service manual for uh, torque specs. Get that set to where you need to be. If that is not exactly where you feel just quite comfortable enough for that, the shift rod here can be adjusted as well. You've got two little turnbuckles here on each end and you've got your shift rod here. They do have lock nuts on them. What you want to do, in this case you're on the soft tail, get the uh, nut out of the way here, get your bolt out. Once you get this out, you can break your lock nuts loose here on either end. Usually my preference is, is I go ahead and use this front turnbuckle here turn this out a couple turns, see where my position's at. If I don't like that, I can turn the shift rod inside this turnbuckle and get a little bit in or out, whichever direction we need to go. That'll get you fine tuned for it. Once you feel comfortable where you're at, put your lock nuts back down, torque them to spec, put your nut and bolt back inside here, depending on which model you're at, torque that to spec, go ahead and sit on it, make sure everything feels good to you. And if it is, there you go. Boom, guns you make, you're ready to ride for the day. So with that, quick little short and easy to the, to the point, little uh, tech tip for you. Make sure you uh, share this video, leave us a comment, hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, ring that bell, and don't forget we'll see you on down the road here. Have a good day.